Today we're looking at the latest in the BATCO range from ISDT. It's the E625. It's a 6x12 watt 2.5 amp charger, especially for 1S batteries. If you're into your tiny whoops or just starting out on your FPV journey, there's a good chance you're going to come across the 1S LiPo. They normally come with smaller chargers capable of charging one or two batteries, but the E625 will charge six. It will charge LIHV and LiPo batteries and has both PH 2.0 and BT 2.0 charging ports on top. You can power it with a USB-C or a bigger LiPo through the two connectors on the back. For the fastest charging, you should use a PD charger of 30 watts or more, but it will charge with your average phone charger, which is normally 18 watts. It will charge as low down as 8 watts too. The charger has ventilation at one end. On the back, it's just playing with four rubber feet. And on the other end, it's a fan for cooling. On the front, we have the up and down buttons, 6 BT and 6 PH charge ports for your batteries, and a 1.9 inch IPS color display. The first thing I like about the charger is you can check your battery's voltages without plugging it into the USB C or another LiPo. It uses the battery's power and it will flash up for about 4 seconds, which is all you need. The voltage will go from 3.4 volts up to 4.35. The amps will go from 0.5 amps up to 2.5. To use it, long press the top button. The volts will start flashing. Now use the top button to scroll through. Anything under 3.85 is discharging, so there is no amps. As soon as we go past that, the amps appear. You can now change the amps with the bottom button. Now I've set it to 4.2 volts, 0.5 amps. Long press the top button again. Short press will start charging. Short press it again and it will stop charging. All the information is really clear. As you can see, there's no problem charging six batteries at once, giving you all the information you need. Long press the bottom button will mute and unmute it. I do use the pH connectors. I use them with the Aquila batteries and these leads. And I must say, these go in and come out a lot easier than my old charger. I always felt like I was going to break the cables when I pulled out the old ones. The T2 connector is a lot more common nowadays anyway. I do like the way it covers up the second port so you can't accidentally put two batteries in the one channel. I really didn't have much to compare it to. I've only ever used these two battery chargers, which are very cheap, and this one here, which has literally just got an on off button. So this is a considerable upgrade for me, and I really do like it. It will happily run off a power bank, which means you can take it out in the field with you as well. All the specifications are on the screen now. Just pause it if you need to read it all. The charger is due to release any day now. The links will be in the description as and when I have them. It will be available on Amazon, or you can check out the Drone Shack Amazon store. If you like the video, please leave a like and consider subscribing. See you on the next one.